Hi, this is Frank Lauer from EuroLeague TV. I'm here with Sasha Kaum from Seska Moscow on semifinals practice night, just 24 hours from the big show. And of course, you've been here several times knocking on the door for that trophy that you want. But what's going to make the difference going into this weekend to make sure you get it this time? I think determination for our team. You know, I think uh, last year we came, we had a good season, you know, and we came to the Final Four, and I think we were expected to see what we saw, you know, and I th hopefully this year we all be determined and focused enough to f get the job done. Okay, you got tom tomorrow night, you have Maccabi Electra, Tel Aviv, and that means you'll be banging against one of the strongest men in basketball, <laughs> Sophocles Sochanidis. You've done it before. What's it like, and what are you planning to do with him tomorrow? Uh, it's definitely tough, you know, he's a big guy, very strong, you know, he likes to post a lot and you know once he's in the game that's all they do you know they just post him up because that's what I would do you know and uh, it's gonna it's gonna take the whole team effort to get him you know to stop him to double team him to have proper rotations and stuff and you know just try to do the best we can okay and when they change Sofo out they bring in a smaller uh, center Alex Tyus has had a great second half of the season gives them a small lineup you guys have to adjust to that don't you exactly yeah we're gonna have to be very focused on what we have to do you know because with two different bigs we have to play two different styles of defense and with Tyus we have to be concerned about the lobs that they throw for him and all the slips on the screens and stuff so we have to be you know watching out for that and so it it'll, it'll be a challenge but it'll be fun of course Seska's had great defense all year league leader in defense by the end of the season but also uh setting records and assists and you're on the receiving end of a lot of those assists you like to dunk yourself uh does that give you some confidence those two combinations of qualities your team has going into this game Definitely. I think, you know, defense is something that wins championships. You know, if you play good defense and if you stop the other team from scoring, you have a pretty good chance of winning. And, you know, offensively, I think we have a lot of good talent on the team that can score. You know, we have good passers. We have good low post scorers. We have, you know, I can run and dunk and stuff. So, um, you know, we have all the weapons I think that we need. It's just a matter of just getting the job done. And, of course, uh, last question. Of course, you beat Maccabi twice during the, during the season in the top 16. Do you go in tomorrow night trying to erase those from your mind and play a brand new game, or do you take some confidence from those two victories? I mean, I think we have to not think about that because, you know, this is the Final Four and everything can happen. And, you know, if you, if you look back at those games, the first game was kind of early in a you know, you know, first part of the top 16, and you know they were, they were missing some guys. They didn't have tires in, and Smith was missing. And then second game, you know, I don't think maybe the both teams kind of took the game as serious as they should have because you know everyone ever thought that the places were already decided and stuff. So you know, it's, it's, pro it's probably wasn't the importance of the games there, you know. But this is uh, this is all, you know. The, this is a, this is the final four, and I think. You know, Maccabi will play their best and Sasko will play their best and uh, hopefully the best team will win. Okay, Sasha Khan, thanks. Uh, good to see you again at the Final Four and good luck. Thank you.